Hi. I'm going to make the video regarding, um, seems like it comes again and again from my spirit and letting you know that I'm coming out revealing that I am a spiritual guide. I've had this calling on my life since I was uh, a teenager, maybe younger than that, knowing of it as a teenager, but younger than that, doing things that people would say, I'm crazy, something up with you, and even including my mom, <laughs> but that's not what this is about. But regarding messages coming over and over again regarding our minds going in touch within the reason the reason I believe God is bringing this more and more to the surface and having his spiritual guides his uh, seers or whatever you want to call them come out and and keep giving this message over and over is because we are in the time where everybody can now tap into their spiritual connection without uh, a mediator. You can go within the guides, the seers, or psychics, or whatever you may want to call them. They're really just to help you get on the right track and it's basically confirming what was already been told to you in your spirit but because you're so busy and you're you're cluttered your mind is cluttered you're you're getting confused and 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 being tossed to and fro you know but instead of locking into you're not really knowing if it's you or if it's somebody else or if it's God the guides are there to really pinpoint you in that direction that and, and, and again it's basically confirmation it shouldn't be anything new to you that you're hearing it should all be a confirmation of what you've already because God knows how to reach out to everybody or your most high or your your source of energy again Jesus whatever you want to call it you know to me that's very immaterial we need to be getting off of that by now but um, what keeps coming to my spirit to bring out to the whole humankind, mankind, my people, my community, my loved ones, is we really need to learn how to tap into our inside voice. And the way to go about that is we have to learn how to quiet our spirits, our minds, our bodies. And that means simply just taking a, just sit down and breathe. Oxygen, oxygen is our life source. And when we breathe, it is really breathing in that life source. It can really calm down things in your mind, in your body, that oxygen, life. But to separate from your phone, your computer, the busy activities. Sometimes we could be sitting down and our minds can still be racing. With the past, with the future, or what are we doing now? But sometimes sit down, quiet yourself. Breathe and don't think. Let ideas come to you. Let his voice rise up within. Quiet all those other sounds, inside, outside, distractions. It's time to learn how to quiet our inside, our mind, our bodies, so we can hear What's, what, what thus saith our source energy, our power, higher power, our God. Again, messages about defrag the mind, uh, 
uh, listening to your inside voice. And here it is again and again. Messages regarding listening to the inside voice. And the way to go about that is be quiet. Practice how to be quiet. Sit down or walking or doing something you love to do. But without being, th without thinking of the past, the future, or what now, don't think of anything. Just enjoy what you're doing. Just breathe, relax, and let it come to you. Take what you will. Have a good day.